it's Mark from Truth Seeker. And uh, I'm in Seoul, I think it's 603, something like that. I'll, uh, of course, I'll always leave the links in the description. And the first thing that caught my eye is this train structure. You see how it's got this weird, uh, I don't know if this is manipulation back here. As you can see, there's something here, and then it's got this weird front piece that's just hanging in the air. It almost looks like it's two pieces, and it's got this weird front piece. Then it almost looks like it's got a hose coming to something back here. I mean, do you see what's coming out of it? This squiggly hose? I mean... I, I just don't know what to think of it, but it's in, I, down this part where I'm going with this underneath, I, I think there was some manipulation on from the computer, NASA's point, but here there's definitely manipulation. See how they block this out? There's something here with something sticking up. Looks like to be some type of tools maybe laying there. Some more manipulation. I mean, they're they're just making a mess of these pictures. There's really no rhyme or reason. They're just making a mess. I guess they're figuring if we find something, we're really gonna have to search for it now. But uh, they're really just butchering these. I mean, I see manipula manipulation everywhere, just almost every part of it. I mean, this is all fake. I don't care what anybody says. This is all CGI covering. This really stood out to me. You can see where it's underneath this fake covering. You see this thing? Looks like it's got little, I don't know, hand, fingers or whatever coming out of it. They're not fingers, but I'm just saying that that's what they look like. And it's underneath all this fake, this fake blur in here. There's a couple, there's a couple of cool things like this stuff, it's just, see? This is a new thing NASA's done. They're making it look like uh, mounds of sand. You can see what looks to be maybe like almost even like a fish carved into there. You see what they're covering? They're just covering carvings with that, that's all. And what they did here. See all these carvings that are in this rock? I mean, just follow me with this. See this here? This line? This is all fake. All of this here. This is all added. All CGI. And then they put some type of covering. This is just a black. See how it, it bleeds? The gray, the black. This is just a covering over this statue. That's all it is. You can see the ornate. And then you come back here and you can see what looks to be, follow my pointer. It almost looks like a fish. See the eye? See the gills back here? Not saying that's what it is, but there's definitely something carved there. Now follow this. There's the one eye. There's the next eye. There's the opening of the mouth. The head comes around like this. And down. And there's some type of carving on the front of them. See this almost looks like there's some type of hatch or something. But that's just that's just what's under there. They're just trying to cover this stuff. See how I mean, this looks like almost like a towel hanging over something. There's a couple of things here, they blurred this out. But you see how this wrinkles? This almost looks like it's a piece of cloth hanging over something. You see what's coming straight up here? And here's more of that fake, this fake BS, there's something there. This quote is pretty pretty odd. Just 
just the shape of it. And then the structure of this rock. Oh, look at this. Look at the symmetry in this thing, the way it was carved. Now, one or two things. Either this is a real rock or it's fake. I'm leaning more towards fake because of this piece right here that they missed. See how it looks like a piece of metal coming out or a handle or something. See that? They put this white blur. See how they try to shade it. And what, the second reason I lean for this being fake is because of the shadow. The shadow doesn't match the uh, item. The, the shadow is just not right. The shadow should be coming like, like this, more to a point, like a sharp point. And then more, it just not, it just doesn't match right. I'm no expert, but it just doesn't match right to me. And you see this thing here that they're blurring? These I lean more towards uh, being maybe like gravestones or something. A couple of little little anomalies there. And see how this comes up like it's a, like a ball, and then a smaller ball, and a smaller ball on a stick. There's another one. There's something there, but you see how this one comes up? Oh, there's like one, two, three to progressively get bigger. Let's see if I can get that in there for you. Let's see what I can do. I tried making this video on Cam Studio. It's just horrible. It just and my other video capture software it just came out absolutely disgusting. And I'm using all the highest settings. I'm just not getting this video capture software it's just like giving me what I want. I'm gonna buy another one and another piece of software and play around with it. See what I can come up with. I'm just not liking any of the video capture software. I'm just losing something. Oh, losing something. And it's just not, you know, just not making me happy. Where I could really show you where they're manipulating the pictures, I'm really losing that with the video capture software. See how this is fake? See how it just fades? See, there's something under this. When you see these lines like this, these are just fake. They make them look like slate and slabs, and it's just, just all CGI. Like this rock here. You see this rock? This is all fake. You see what's coming out of the top of it, the handle? There's more here. See what's back here? It almost looks like a statue. I mean, this is all, I believe this all will be like fake. There could be a small little piece of a rock here, and then they just start adding to it. See, it's got these weird lines in it. And see back here, what was here? This is a perfect example of the bullshit with NASA. This is not a rock. Do you see what's in here? You see? There's a statue. You see this? I'm now outlining it. There's a hole right there in it. You see it comes up. There's like two eyes here. You see what's in there? You see this black part of it? See, their software is, is not, well, they can't go too dark. They got to leave it a little opaque and, you know, they, they fade it in a little bit. They, they, they de-sharpen the edges and they end up leaving this stuff out. And look what's here. I mean, it looks like there's almost like a statue right next to it that they blurred. And you can see there's something here. This is just fake. And with today's technology, a couple of clicks and it's done. I mean, it's just... You're not talking about like the old days. See how they blurred this? Another, another little statue there. Like I said, this part I believe we're going through graveyards.
I believe they landed there for a reason. I mean, they couldn't just drop this thing in a highly, highly populated area. And number two, I don't think they were allowed to. You see these carvings? I believe some of these areas to be very sacred. But, you know, I, like I've been saying, I believe our government has permission. They may have permission to bring in a major catastrophe, you know, a thousand people to Mars. But I'm sure there's somebody in charge up there. You can't, they're not gonna let, and there's no way our whole civilization, God forbid if there was a major disaster coming. See, look at the Yellowstone erupted. <laughs> the elite are gone. They had, if we had a major, major eruption, the elite are gone, guys. See this? That's just a, just a statue, and they put some blur around it. So it's nothing, nothing big. See this? It looks like a circle. The rest of that is just buried in that blur. All that fake sand that they had. All right, guys, this was going to be a quick one. You know, I just wanted to point out a couple of cool things. When you when you download it, go take a look at this area here and see what you think. To me, they added this black smudge there for a reason. To me, on my computer screen, I could see a couple of really cool things here. But a lot of times they just don't translate, you know, really good. You know, like I see piping. See how this piece of pipe comes up? But I see, there's all types of things in there. They just add this nonsense around it. So I just call it nonsense. Nonsense and trickery. That's all it is. And, uh, there's just no need for it. But, if you look at my analogy and what they're covering up, they have to keep this lie up. Alright guys, I got a couple coming down the pipe today. Happy Easter to everybody. You know what Truth Seeker is going to be doing today. There's no ham for me.